Hello gorgeous! So this video is sort of a prequel to the prom lookbook video which I did with Melissa and this I'm just getting her ready for this doing her hair and makeup and I wanted to share it with you guys. If you haven't seen my prom lookbook video make sure to click the link in the top right hand corner. I'm just starting here with the Revlon Colorstay foundation and I am blending it in with my Beauty Blender sponge. I'm using the Rimmel Scandalized Eyeshadow Stick in white just to give a, a solid white base to her eyes. And then I'm going in with the Naked 3 palette in just different colors and creating a pretty springy look. I love using makeup wipes to clean up as I'm going to get that really sharp, distinct line on the eyes. And my favorite makeup wipes right now are actually by Oil of Olay. Girls, you already know, eyebrows are the most important feature on the face in my opinion. So I am just defining them and giving her a beautiful arch. I'm using my favorite gel liner by Maybelline and giving her just a black, kind of cat eye effect. Holy Grail Cream Foundation by Cover FX to highlight and contour. And if you guys want to see that routine, I do have a video on my channel, so check that out. I'm going in with Hula Benefit Bronzer and I'm just building up her contour. Blend it out, blend it out, blend it out, blend it out. That is what I'm doing. Melissa has these beautiful, naturally plump lips that I'm super jealous about, but I decided to really accentuate those with a mix of different pinks to bring them out and just make them really pretty for spring. My final makeup step is actually my favorite makeup step, and that's highlighting. I'm using my favorite highlighter, which is the e.l.f. Baked Highlighter, and I'm just using it to uh, run it along the bridge of her nose and her cheekbones and the inner corners of her eyes just to really make everything pop. All right, ladies, let's do some hair. You guys might not know about this about me, but I love doing hair, and Melissa's got the fullest, thickest hair, and it was a lot of fun to play with. I decided to go for a simple look, just taking two pieces right above her ears and just pinning it back and doing a little bit of a bouffant in the back of her head, just adding a little bit of volume. I decided to back home the under layers of her hair just to add a little bit extra volume. We decided that adding some loose waves and curls in her hair would just give her an overall more romantic look. It was perfect. So this is the final look, guys. This is her with her springy makeup and romantic hair, and I think it was perfect, and it's a great look for prom, especially if you have shoulder-length hair. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you all so much. And make sure to leave comments below of anything you'd like to see me do. And don't forget to visit my blog, www.angelalanter.com. Au revoir. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Did that hurt? No. Sorry. <laughs>